sacred hour. Witness the uniting of these two devoted hearts and the enduring bonds of Christian marriage. This most blessed and lasting of human relationships was first celebrated in the quiet bowers of Eden in the time of man's infancy. God saw that it was not good for man to live alone. And so he created woman and gave her to him to be his companion, his wife. And for this cause shall a man leave his father and mother and shall cleave unto his wife, and they too shall be one flesh. Who gives this lady to be married? I do. Thank you. I should take her by the hand to her name, sweet. Mm. Lucky man. <laughs> You take it by the right hand. You got that right, right there. This is chocolate. Now we do this. Ready? Ready? You're good. Yeah, I'm good. Christopher, you are now entering into a relationship with many privileges, privileges, but also many obligations. The woman you are love is about to become your wife. In no way could she so tell of her love for you as by her willingness to turn from her home and loved ones and friends and true true and tried to make her home with you your joy will be hers joy and your sorrows hers christopher lee harvey jackie ray wright we fixing to marry all right ready back it out all right jackie ray you are also entering into a relationship with many privileges and obligations. The man you love is about to become your husband. He tells the world not only of his willingness, but of his expressed desire to turn from all others and to you for all of life ahead. Your love will be his inspiration and your prayers his tower of strength. And now here in the presence of God and these witnesses, do you take each other as husband and wife, agreeing to love each other and devotedly and to promote each other's happiness until this union unto which you are entering, entering is dissolved by death. Do you promise? I do. Okay. I do. Can I have the ring? Hmm? Can I have the ring? ring I thought you were headed. Okay. Yes, this, don't drop it, <laughs> this ring teaches us many lessons. The purity of its metal reminds us of the purity of your love for each other. And the circle reminds us of, us of our eternity of your love, the circle having neither end beginning nor end. Christopher, will you take this ring and place it upon Jackie Ray's finger? And as you do, repeat after me. With this ring? With this ring? I wed. I wed. And all my worldly goods. And all my worldly goods. I thee endow. I thee endow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and health. In poverty and in wealth. In poverty and wealth. Till death us do part. Till death do us part. Can I have her, your ring? Christopher, it is Jackie's raised desire that you too shall wear a ring, a ring to remind you of the purity and the eternity of her love for you. As she places it up on your finger, and as you wear it proudly before men, it will proclaim to all the word, world that you belong to God. You may slap it on there now. And repeat after me. With this ring, With this ring I wed, and all my worldly goods, I thee endow, in sickness and in health, in poverty and in wealth, and poverty and in wealth. Till, death do us part. till death do us part. And now, having pledged your love for and loyalty to each other, and having sealed the pledge with, these, with the marriage rings, I do, by the authority vested in me as a minister in the church of the living God, and in conformity with the laws of the state, pronounce you husband and wife. And what God has joined together, let not man put asunder. Let us pray. Add thy blessings, our Heavenly Father, where these two winsome young people, in whose hearts thou hast inspired a lasting love, have said the words that and have made them one in the eyes of society. Bless them as they turn now to walk the path of life together. Give them thy guidance in every tender and intimate adjustment to living together. Bestow upon them, we pray, the fulfillment of the dreams and prayers that they, they have cherished their, all through their days, for their love and for their home in the course of the year to come, if it is thy will, grant them that the laughter of little children, the peace which passes understanding at their fireside, and all of the things that make a house into a home. Remind them, our Father, that, that loving thee 
does not take away from the, each, each other, their, their love for each other. We know that love in thee increases our capacity to love those who are dearest to us, for God is love. Bless the homes for which they have come, but especially bless the house that they may establish and may be, fulfill thy purpose and thy will. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Christopher, you may kiss your wife. Yeah, amen. Ready? I now present to you Mr. and Mrs. Christopher Lee Harvey.